so I guess I have some splaining to do. Uh, it's been seven months since the last time I uploaded. You are probably thinking that I was just dropped out of it. Well, I got really busy, actually. Like, really busy. First of all, YouTube, how the fuck you doing? Baseball Dipper 1-4 back for another video. Yeah, another video seven months later. So, um, a lot's a lot's been a lot's been going on. So, uh, my first semester in my senior year didn't go too well. So I had to really buckle down for my second semester, and baseball was going on. So it was kind of heavy on me. Um, and then now with summer coming around, I had a lot of stuff to do with college coming up. I had baseball this summer. Uh, I'm working five days a week, 6.30 a.m. to 6.30 p.m. Um, like right now it's 11 o'clock um, and I have to be at work at 6.30 tomorrow morning. But, you know, I, I'm, I'm ready to get back into it and um, I'm going to try and get back on it, try and make one at least one video every week or so um you know especially with college coming up I, I don't want my grades to get get down too low and uh you know all that but i think it'll be easier you know if, if when i do have some free time just to throw up the camera and, and make a video so that's what i'm planning on doing just want to let you guys know that uh but we are going to do a dip review today um for the past seven months, I've been doing Grizzly Wintergreen. Just Grizzly Wintergreen. Uh, so I haven't really been been venturing out too much, and um, I ventured out the other day, and uh, and you know I, I I took a pinch of this dip, and I was like, I wanted to throw up. All right, this is Grizzly Mint. But, after doing a whole can, and this is my second can, it's not bad. And it's been cracked, sorry. Uh, but, my lights were flickering. Um, it's, it's not as bad as I remember it, so. Anyways, let's go ahead and put in a pinch. Get some music going first. Little Toki. <sighs> Here we go. You know what? For you guys, because I haven't been back, because I haven't been here in a while, I'm gonna take a big ass fucking bitch. All right, so here we go. Like I said, I've uh, I've dipped a, a little bit of it, um, but this is this is really strong stuff. It's, it's just like Grizzly Wintergreen, except instead of smelling wintergreen, I smell mint. Um, so you see this crater right here? That whole little thing? That's going in my mouth. Yep, that is. I'll try and separate it for y'all real quick. It's nice and packed together, so. See that? All that right there. Just for you guys. Because um, I feel like I have some making up to do. So, oh. Oh. Either I'm a pro packer or I, I'm a pro packer. Let's just say that. No, that's a that's a brick. That's not. I didn't pinch it at all. I just pulled that out. Look, it's even got the end. Of, it's even like shaped along the can. Okay. Too much mint. Mm. 
That made my eyes water. I'm not gonna lie, that just made my eyes water. I got new mud jugs. America. And then I got a blue one. And that's it. I sold my red one for like 15 bucks. I mean, it was free. So I sold it for 15 bucks, pure profit. Uh, I took it on my team. And he appreciated it. So that one smelled like asshole anyway. So I was just like, yeah, take it. Go ahead. But yeah, so. My joke of the day is going to be, what well, now my Confederate camera one smells like shit because it's been in my car uh, this whole time, but yeah, so, American flag. I just want y'all to see this. Yeah. So as you can see, growing out my facial hair a little bit, uh, trying to anyways. I think it's pretty freaking cool. Red beards. Those are awesome. So, I wanted to grow out a red beard. So I did. What the fuck? Who cares? I'm going to try and turn this light off. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. That's much better. Okay. So, I go to school on the 16th. Just the other day, I was getting my senior pictures. What the hell? Time just flies by now. But I go on the 16th and then baseball starts on the 20th. So I have like four days to do nothing and kind of accustom myself to the campus and uh, find my classes and all that. I got a pretty good schedule. Uh, I don't. My earliest class is 10 o'clock, and my latest class is 2 o'clock on any certain day so for a first semester freshman year that's really good uh, but you know my latest class is from 2 to 250 and then baseball starts at 330 that's a full day but eh, especially my Mondays my Mondays are gonna suck it's 10 to 1050 11 to 1150 one to one fifty, two to two fifty, three thirty practice. But I have one class on Tuesday, three on Wednesday, two on two on Thursday, and three on Friday. I can't complain, really, honestly. Um, I got one of the best schedules. But I, uh, I'm majoring in communications. In case y'all didn't know that, I don't know if I said that before. I like it. I mean, it's been a while, so uh, majoring in communications and uh, radio broadcasting, to be specific. Um, so that'll be cool. I'm actually, I actually already got an internship uh, working at um, Lexington High School, doing uh, the Friday night football games. Not like speaking, but helping out the guy that does. Um, so that'll be cool. Uh, I'll be able to do that on Friday nights. Um, yeah, uh, so that'll be cool. And then, um, I saw my room. I went for orientation the other day. And I saw, I got to see my room. I actually got a corner room, so it's, uh, bigger than, than the rest. And Newberry is a really small campus. I mean, like... It's 90 acres, which is like nothing. Like I've hunted in fields that are bigger than that. So, and there's like 900, well, 1,100 students. Small school. It's private, but you know it's it's perfect for me. So, there's one dorm that all freshmen live in, and it's uh, it's co-ed. Hell yeah. Um, <laughs> uh, it'll be. Let's say I'm on the first floor, so that'll make moving in easy. And it's on a corner right next to an exit door. No entrance, it's just an exit door. So there won't be much traffic there unless people just feel like leaving all night. Um, so, yeah, uh, that's pretty much it for Newberry. Um, 
I'll probably make a video when I get there. Definitely. Honestly. Um, just an update video, not a review, probably. Um, but, yeah. Let's see. What else? What was there? What else was I going to talk about? Huh? Let's just go ahead and review this. So, Grizzly Mint. You know, uh, normal Grizzly can. No difference. Um, it's really strong mint flavor. And I got sick off of mint one time, and that's why I hated it. And then I put, you know, that's why that first pinch I was, like, made me throw up. And I was like, this is the worst dip ever. But I wasn't going to waste it. I was going to I was gonna finish it. And by the time I finished it, I was like, mm, that wasn't too bad, I guess. I'll go... I'll go get another can just just because just for a review because I wanted to review it and so I got another can for a review ended up dipping a bunch of it because I ran out of wintergreen and I didn't want to go to the store and buy another one so I just ended up dipping some of it and yeah um it's just like every other grizzly except it's mint flavored I'm, I'm really not a big fan of mint honestly but and this I'm not gonna dip this all the time and honestly, it's hurting right now. It's burning like a bitch. <laughs> okay, let's see. What else? I really don't have anything else, so uh, I'm just going to make this one kind of short. Uh, I just wanted to tell y'all that I'm back, bitches. <laughs> it's not kind of fucking gay. And I apologize right now. But, I said it, and I'm not redoing this video because of that, so, and I just keep rambling about it, which is making it even stupider. So I'm going to stop, and uh, say until next time, this has been Baseball Dipper 1-4, and we'll see you next time. Don't forget, I'm going to start keeping up with my Twitter. I think I have like 11 tweets right now, because I just stopped with it because I wasn't doing videos, so. I'm going to start doing that again. If you haven't, go subscribe to that. And that light's really starting to fucking bug me. Um, Baseball Dipper 1-4. And then subscribe to this channel. Uh, like I said, it's going to be coming out with more videos. Um, so, And, and I've, seen, I've seen a spike in uh, subscribers. You know, Even though it's not that many, it's, it's still a spike for not, not putting out any videos. Like, I was kind of impressed, and that kind of motivated me to want to keep making them, because if I can get a small spike like that without doing any videos, what could happen if I actually do do videos? You know, now that I got an, a small fan base, well, not really fan base, but small subscriber base, they'll be able to see them, share them, maybe my subscriber base will get even bigger, so... This kind of motivation. So thank you to you 24 people that have subscribed. I appreciate every single one of you. And to those thinking about subscribing, please do. Who doesn't want to look at a ginger for 13 minutes? With a big old fatty in. <laughs> Anyways, guys, I appreciate you watching. Um, hit that like button. Comment. Uh, dislike. I don't care. Do whatever. But if you do dislike, tell me why. Tell me why you hated this video. Was I boring? Probably. 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 Words. Use them. Um, so, yeah. Just let me know. Alright? Uh, I appreciate it. Thank you guys. I'll see you next time. Ugh.